technically, cloning the GitHub repository is also an option to install Magento. However, this approach should only be used when working on the Magento core, for example during a community contribution day. It should not be used as a means to install Magento for a project. The main problem with this approach is that several important files that need to be modified during the lifetime of a project are under version control. For example, one benefit that using a GitHub clone seems to have at first is that upgrades could be as simple as running git pull. But this does not take into account any dependency constraints specified in a modules composer JSON file. That's why project upgrades should be done by composer and not git. Also, when using a GitHub based installation, conflicts with upstream are common, for example in the root composer JSON file. If an extension needs to be installed, this means adding a line to the require section. Then, if the upstream composer JSON file is changed, like it happens frequently during an upgrade, a git pull will easily result in a merge conflict. Well, let's assume you do want to create a pull request to the core. Maybe we are going to participate at a contribution day or maybe we found a bug and want to contribute a fix. Or maybe we are part of the Magento engineering team. For this we need a working copy of the Magento 2 repository. All we need to do is copy the repository URL and run git clone. But because the Magento 2 repository has grown huge over time, it's a good idea to create a shallow clone by adding the argument dash dash depth one unless we need local access to all the history. That way, most of the history is omitted from the local repository and our clone will be ready a lot quicker. So I'll copy the URL and run git clone depth run and we can specify the target directory as an argument. And that's it. By the way, if you do want to contribute to Magento by creating a pull request, be sure to ask the community engineering team first what branch to use. And that wraps up installing Magento by cloning the GitHub repository.